Studie des äh, Glyphosat Renewal Assessment Reports. This is only in English. An analysis of gaps in deficient defi size from Dr. Peter Klausing. Executive Summary The Renewal Assessment Report, RAR, is the basis of the legal decision whether approval should be granted for future use of glyphosate within the European Community. The RAR is supposed to provi provide <coughs> the results the results of the assessment made by <coughs> made by the authorities of a uh, dossier that the appliance i e the industry on your case the glyphosate task force g t V is obliged to submit. The analysis at hand provides evidence for serious defi deficiencies of the RAR in Cruiser's area of risk assessment. Mm. The most important examples Examples are provided in the areas of genotoxicity, of genotoxicity and calcinogenicity. The deficiencies include neglect and wrong description of important scientific publications, lack of applying up to data statistics Statistics, statistical analysis to the data provided by industry and false statements about historical control data used to dismiss important results from carcinogenicities. Car carcinogenicity. Studies in mice. Specific Specifically, consideration of mechanistic evidence for glyphosates, carcinogenicity effects, i.e., oxidative stress and genotoxicity is missing or insufficient. The report remains mute about oxidative stress and related to genotoxicity and almost wondered of the scientific literature on genotoxicity is missing. In, ad in addition, at least one important study on genotoxicity received a false and a distorted description by the BFR Furthermore, the handling of an immortal mouse, Cargan carcinogenicity study by an industry, i.e. not applying state-of-the-art statistical methods and wrong claims about historical control data, gives the impression that this was done deliberately. Deliberately. The current analysis demonstrated omissions and distortions of facts in the toxicology and metabolism part of the draft RRR that was submit submitted to the EFSR, EFSA, the Bundes Institute for Risikobewertung. 
Federal Institutes for Risk Assessment, BAFR, which was in charge of this part of the RAR, the full responsibility for these agaps and deficiencies. The German government claims that the BFR performed a detailed quality assert examination of all original studies and the studies published in the scientific literature. The present analysis conjectures the statement by providing evidence that the agency overlooked or ignored important findings and that numerous publications from the scientific literation, literate, literature have not even been taken into consideration. Failure of analysis and distori distortion of facts nourishes the suspicion that this was done on purpose. It should be noted, be noted that this assessment is based on a review of the 31 March 2015 version of the RAR, which is publicity not available. Introduction To understand the background of the present analysis, a short description of the approval produced procedure for presidice is given below. In addition, what led us to perform this analysis is briefly described. In the European community, the legislation for the marketing of pesticides Pesticides is laid down in Regulation EC No 1107-2009. According to this regulation, the active ingredients of pesticides, in your case, glyphosates, have the have to be reapproved every 10 years. For this rare approval industry, the appliance is obliged oblige to submit a dossier which contains all new information about the pesticide that had accumulated during the 10-year period prior to sub submission of the dossier. In case of glyphosate, the appliance was a consortium of corporations. The, co the, the glyphosate task force GTV, the, this dossier complied by the GTV includes a volume of toxicology and metabolism. The basis for the safety assessment of the pesticide to be performed by the authorities. The toxicology, the toxicology and metabolism part of the do dossier and the scientific literator. Regulator studies follow definitely study design according to the OECD guidelines and have to be performed or commissioned by the appliance. Why is the study reports are confidential and only disclosed to the authorities' summaries? Of the reports are present in the dossier, which is publicly available. In addition, the applicant is obliged to perform a literate search co covering the last 10 years prior 
to the submission of the dossier. All relevant studies from the literation research have to be included in the dossier and for those considered not relevant the reason why the particular study has been excluded to be described. The industry is allowed to select a country. The so-called reporting member state RMS what is where the dossier is to be assessed this is to say that the authorities of the RMS are generating the renewal assessment report. The final version of this report is submitted to the European Food Safety Authority EFSA, which based on a peer review makes a proposal to the European Commission. Directorate General for Health and Food Safety concerning the future marketing approval of the pesticide. In case of the renewal procedure, procedure uh, for glyphosate, Germany was selected by the GTF as the RMS. While the Bonus Institute for Verbraucherschutz, BFL, Federal Office for Consumer Protection and Food Safety, had the overall responsibility. The Bonus Institute for Risiko Bewertung, BFL, became responsible for the assessment of the humanity, humanity safety aspects. i.e. the toxicology and metabolism. In December 2013, the first draft of the renewal assessment report RAR, of glyphosate was finalized and made available for public comment in, in April May 2014. According to the BFR, all public comments were including, included in. An update version of the RAR, which has not been officially published, according to available information, Green, AT, uh, AR, 2015, BFR, press release of two. The 2nd April 2015, at least two updates of the RAR, R -A -R, were produced on as of 20, 29th January 2015 and one of as of end of March 2015. The end of March version was submitted by the RMIs, i.e. Germany, to the EFSA in early April. Various scientists, scientists close to industries seem to have had access to the 29th January 2015 version. C.F. Graham et al. 2015 Civil society was denied this access even after inquiry. And therefore unable to evaluate. evaluate. To evaluate. What of the civil society submission from the commenting 